This is the latest custom come out of the shop. It's a scratch built one third scale of Forter Plane. Uh, Forter Plane is a ultralight meant to be built in somebody's garage using just uh, a drill press, pipe bender, and a cutoff saw. Uh, this one's uh, was sitting on a six foot table. It's an eight foot wingspan. Uh, I might be able to find one other example of third scale, and that was in Brazil. Um, a lot of guys built quarter scale, so this is pretty much one of a kind. Um, started with uh, just some three, uh, three view, and a few diagrams I was able to find. And this one helped a lot getting the um, gussets right. The V sludge is made of a three quarter inch pine, tail and wing, or standard balsa hardwood construction. The uh, fuselage, or the body part of it, is aluminum. Just aluminum flashing, weighs nothing. Uh, cowling is a uh, fiberglass. Um, electric brass is going to go here. The uh, It's bottled up to a real one. It's not quite scale. Um, it's more inspired by it. Uh, no two of these things are built alike. Um, this one has clipped wings, it's kind of a Clark Y airfoil. Um, went with push rods instead of cables for the ailerons. Servos are hidden in fuselage. Um, tails hidden are the aluminum seat. And uh, see there's the one for the um, ailerons. The uh, required five gallon gas tank which all watch lights have. It's fiberglass, it's hollow. Um, made up a mold. That would just not work out. Use one, uh, one layer of three ounce cloth. It just wasn't quite thick enough, a little too flimsy. New one's two layers, weighs a little less than two ounces. Uh, tail wheel on the real one is uh, supposed to be a shopping cart caster. So I made up one that made steerable. Um, instead of using cables and rods, just uh, in our rods. Um, show the ailerons here. When all this exposed, should be plenty of travel for that. The uh, whole thing is going to weigh about 14 pounds. But, uh, not bad for a plane this big. Um, all the writing on it is done by hand because the uh, original was. Um, even down to the, the incorrect font for army. What are you going to do? Uh, it just, it's covered in SIG coverall. Um, sealed with um, water-based polyurethane. Spray painted with the uh, Rust-Oleum uh, green paint, the um, camouflage green. We have a light coat of water-based acrylic because the that camouflage paint just scuffs up too easy. Uh, the wing struts are just uh, three eighths inch dowels, but um, the ends have an eighth inch aluminum inset, pinned and glued, so they don't go any place. Cables are, I don't think they're necessary so much, but they are scale and they're functional. It's taut. So, a few things work out. We'll get our airborne, but we'll get that done this spring.